Tenebo possesses Christ-like quality. Christian leaders should do well to emulate him. Kenyamo says, welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. The chairman of the All Progressive Party, APC, campaign group, Fastos Kenyamo, has stated clearly that the presidential candidate of the APC, Bola Tenebo, possesses a special Christ-like quality. According to him, he stated that Bola Tenebo does not hesitate to forgive all those that betrayed him in one way or another. He further urged pastors and church leaders to learn from him. Festus made this known in a statement he released on his Twitter handle in the early hours of Saturday, 24th of November, 2022. Festus came on Twitter with thus, The ability of Tunembu to easily forgive those who betrayed him continues to inspire millions of Nigerians. Mm -hmm. This is a special Christ-like quality and is a reflection of a type of tolerant president he would be. Many shepherds of the faith might do well to emulate him. And the quest to reveal the good qualities of Bola Tunembu, Kenya must stated. We should recall that Tunembu visited Northern Bishop amidst criticisms emanating in Nigeria as a result of his Muslim Muslim ticket. At the cost of his visitation, Tunembu assured them that the interests of Christians will be protected in his administration. If you ask me, all these things is not necessary. Coming out to say a particular presidential candidate is, a, is Christ like, you know. <laughs> I don't want to say it's a lie, but Shubon, something is ringing in my head. You know, something is always ringing in my head. The fact that Ambode was, you know, removed from being the governor of APC State. Ambode, that's the, 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 the most recent former governor of Lagos State who did only one tenure. Like, the governor that has only done one tenure since, you know, 1999. Others have been doing two tenors. He has been the only one that did one tenure. What exactly? Why Tunibu no forgiven? Okay, let, let, let's even start from there. Why didn't? Why wasn't he forgiven? Huh? Why exactly was not? Was he not forgiven? Hmm. It is. I find it. I find it. I find it very, very un, unnatural for Kenya must sound like this because of waiting. Because now a presidential candidate, you the equate him. You know, say if you talk this thing now for Muslims, if they, if 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 to, ah, deep down there's something I want to say. If you know, say you, your head did there, go talk and for Muslim. Talk, say a particular uh, candidate, they, they do like their prophet Muhammad. They make you come nowhere, they will stone you. Now, this kind of thing they call blasphemy. This is what they call blasphemy. This kind of thing is what they call blasphemy. All people appointed to polish beer, their brief of what to use to sell their product. Bola met to the populace, and as such, they begin to speak without thought. First is Kenyamo liking. Bola made Tenebu to Jesus Christ. First is Kenyamo is short of words. You expect a Jehovah Witness member to know who Christ is. How would they know when they don't even acknowledge him? I beg, make an start. I beg. Make another turn this into Christ's religious studies class. I beg. This is the greatest insult for this foolish and stupid man to liken Tenebu to Jesus Christ. He then not says like, he then not says that like Muhammad or all hell be let loose. He should stop this blasphemy. Exactly what I'm saying. Do you know? That if this man has said this, let him just say um, Kashim Ishim Setima is now liking to, you know, and call Prophet Muhammad. Problem. In short, everywhere goes scatter. Everywhere, as in, that is Igboroma Daru Goni. Igboroma Daru. I'm telling you, what I'm saying here is, can you do so? Sure, Satan possesses Christ's qualities too. They can appear and disappear. Walk some lying miracles, show fake compassion. We know the real deal, not to number, please. This is there is nothing personal we see from this new generation Christianity interpreter. How do you expect a man that made a footmat as for as for Kenya and his family to serve the Lord? What normal people hang on the wall out of reverence just in simple English say, Tunibu is a good man, he has a forgiving heart. Is that too difficult? Okay. Tell your church pastor, so that is it. Ask yourself, if this thing is turned now, if we switch rules, as in we switch, he tells, the same way he says this now, he says this for Kashim Shetima. Problem. Not even minding that Kashim Shetima is his brother. Is a brother. They are going to turn against him. 
to get church pastor to make him an elder in your church, or if you get liver, refuse a statement and put yourself as the actor of the content. You will always find it difficult to sell and <laughs> goodness and expire products. What is the meaning of this expression? So it's 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 wrong. Now this kind thing, they call which they call religious crisis. If have they been eh, Christianity is Islam. Hey, all this time what they talk, you go down where waiting. Proper they go down, they go down. In fact, they go down, they threaten, say make any more comments, and make them deal with and water water. We all know how this thing goes. We all know. And can you more come as I can't why? Sometimes I ask this question. Is it that when they are going for an interview, they don't prepare themselves? They don't ah, ah. you're supposed to put yourself in your interviewer's shoes. There is nothing your interviewer is not going to ask you. And I want to believe that they know that you can actually sell this 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 their this your candidates well. That is why they gave you that particular job of selling your candidates well. I mean it does not make sense. We always find it difficult to sell an expired product. What is the meaning of this expression? A Muslim like Christ? Why not like Muhammad? Very soon he will tell us that Tinubu helped God create. He will tell us that Tinubu helped God create heaven and earth, and it should be worshipped like God. <laughs> Foolish set of people. To me, this is in all angles wrong. Kenyama, whatever they call you, mind your language. You're creating Nigeria greeting politicians who are Lord Jesus Christ. It's an insult of faith. Kind of the same to Islam. Enough of this nonsense. This shows that APC has no regard for Christians. And you know, let me not even let me even bust the bubble. Is Kanyama himself not a Christian? Hmm? Kanyama is liking Tunumbu to be a Christian. Liking Tunumbu to Christ. Kanyama is liking Tunumbu to Christ. You understand? So you ask yourself. See now. Um, what's the called? Uh, uh, what do I even call him? Had it been, hmm? not, not even had it been, Muslims will come and say, imagine, oh, say, Kenyama, who is a Christian, is likening to the book. Those others, we don't have regard. That is why these people come us and say, the, the satans do not have regard. Because, yes, see now, now we the customer and the washers like this. They don't they rate us at all. All this is uncalled for. Sell your products. Market your products. If you know, say, you know, Sabi marketing, he is an opportunity for you to even take courses in marketing. Market your products well. And of course, it all depends if your, your product is good as well. If your product is good as well, I don't think people having, just like if you stand, if you stand in the market and start saying, um, telling people the benefits of a particular soup, you understand? You sing, that, you sing that thing on a daily basis. I tell you, in the second or third week, people that have learned what you said, in the fourth week, people will start saying, okay, let me even buy one and try. So I beg, this is uncalled for. These people should go and learn. They should take courses on marketing, on how to, you know, get people to convince people to, you know, buy their product or buy into what they believe in, rather than, you know, come out and, you know, use this according to Islamic people, blasphemous phrase. All right, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of your day.